yes, a toast. To my bitches, I love y'all so much. Thank y'all for just being in this video. I love y'all prosperity, peace, and blessings to everybody. Today's topic is really just the transgender community. Just transgender period, okay? I'm big pan, baby. <laughs> <laughs> I think everybody's smiling in motherfucking business. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Be unapologetic, baby. Live your life. For sure. Just live your life. Hey! 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 Get that motherfucking paper. Okay. So if you worry about understanding another motherfucker's logic and what they do and why they do it, um, power off. See what I'm saying? Power off. <laughs> <laughs> Dang, she said it for me. Power off. <laughs> Squad, welcome to Shy Shenanigans. It's your girl Shy Shenanigans back with another banger. Hey, 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 hey. hey. Y'all, and I'm, today I am with, with Leo, Lily Morel. Okay, make sure y'all go subscribe to her channel if you haven't already. Hit, hey. hey. brought her up. I'm with Sweet. Hey, <laughs> lifestyle, lifestyle with Kel. Y'all know what's going on. And I'm with my baby Musa. Y'all know what's going on. For real, yeah. Before you get into this video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. subscribe. Turn on your post notifications because you don't want to miss a beat. Did y'all hear me? Though? Did y'all hear it? But did you hear it? Don't want to miss a beat. If you guys are new to this channel, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on your post notifications because you don't want to miss a beat. Okay, Period. so today, guys, we got some pot rolls, mac and cheese, cornbread, and what is this? Cabbage, mm -hmm. baby. We got the hookah going. We got the wine in the cup. Baby. It's a chicken salad. Okay. okay. My shit gone, so don't ask for my shit. <laughs> so we chopping this up. We have a little mukbang for y'all. So y'all just listen to us eat real quick because baby, I gotta get to this break. Okay, we don't cook by the truth. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. The we one and the only. Okay. Fuck! Leo's kitchen, baby. The wife. Mm-hmm. The princess. The princess. The queen. Okay. Hello. Baked mac and cheese. Kevin. Mm. Mm. Well, I should turn on the channel. She's not fucking. I mean, she did that. Everything. Mm. You know, we go back the next day and it busts even harder. Yeah. Listen, next day from when she made the show. Something that's good. Mm. Listen. Mm. 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 To my bitches, I love y'all so much. Thank y'all for just being in this video. I love y'all prosperity, peace, and blessings to everybody. Okay, let's do a thumbnail picture. What do you want to come on, I'm sorry, baby. Thumbnail, hold your glasses up. Ready? One, two. Wait. One, two. You ready? One, two, three. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Mm -hmm. I don't want to waste too much time because I don't want this video to be 50 minutes like the last video. I hope you didn't watch that video or watch it because I, I, it took me three, four days before that video okay. uh, to get it first edited, uh, all edited, like no cap. So go appreciate that video, please. But today, in honor of um, it being Pride Month, happy Pride Month to y'all. I fuck with y'all. Happy Pride Month, baby. You know, real gay, real happy. Y'all know what's going on. Real quick, baby. So. Um, in honor of that, I wanted to bring the topic. First of all, I need to introduce y'all to the set. So basically, I wanted to, something just came to my mind where I wanted to just do mukbangs and debates with people because who don't like to debate and who don't like to share their opinion? And I'm a very opinionated person, so I love when people tell me like different things and make me think about it because I'm just, you know, I just like to talk anyway. So, yeah, we're doing a segment like that on this shy show. <laughs> now, and it's a new thing, and I hope y'all enjoy it. But I have her think of some names that she could should, should call this like, segment. Yeah. Yes, please. That's have right. Have her think of some names. Yes. I'm dropping it on the comment below. Yes, because it's going to be real. Feel me? Like, it ain't going to be no interview type shit, but it's just, I just want to hear everybody. It's going to be like conversational. Yes. Right? Relatable. Yes, exactly. Today's topic is really just the transgender community. Just transgenders, period. Okay? They are very underrated, I feel like. They are very targeted in the LGBTQIA plus community. I don't like it, and I'm always on their side. I support anybody in the freaking LGBTQ, the LGBTQIA plus community. Like, I love love, and it shouldn't matter how you look, or what you got down there, or what you got up here. It shouldn't matter, in my opinion. Yeah, I agree. Mm -hmm. I agree. Because... What's the problem? If you happy, you happy, love you, love you. And up? that's right. Like, come on, don't make it a problem. 
So we just got three topics we're gonna discuss while we chow down this food. And if y'all ready to get, y'all ready to get? Mm-hmm. I'm ready. Are y'all ready? Are you ready? I'm, I'm ready. I'm they ready. ready? They y'all I ready? Think they, I think they're ready. Are y'all ready? They're very ready. <laughs> okay. Guess what? Let's say this just for clarification. Yes. This is a no judgment zone. At so all. Everybody's entitled to their own opinion. Safe what place, you think baby. may not be what we think. What, what you think may not be what we, what we think. No, so, no, no, no. I want y'all to understand, like, just coming to this with an open mind and yes. not thinking that nobody's being targeted yeah, or nobody's, you know, or not just, we just calling out one, like, being favoritism or mm-hmm. anything like that. So I want y'all to know that. Open yeah. discussion. Mm-hmm. So it's not like that. It's just something that I've seen a lot of mm-hmm. transgender people. Yeah, when she wants to speak on it. Yeah, and it's real targeted right now. Like, I just want to, you know, put my voice, my voice in it and my friend's voice in it and my baby's voice in it, period. So we about to get into this video, period. You did this. Mm-hmm. <laughs> she did this for real, for real. Wow. Must get gone. This is a wife, baby. Okay? You Hello. Get it? Hello. I'm not going to tell y'all no more. <laughs> like, hello. Come, come get you something. Okay? <laughs> the first topic I'm going to be talking about is using the bathroom. Now, when I say using the bathroom, I mean like, you know, trans men going into the women's bathroom, men's bathroom, whatever. Like, you know what I mean? So for me personally, I feel like if you dressed up as a woman, go to a women's bathroom. Because what if the woman, the dressed up woman goes into the men's bathroom? They're gonna be mad. You know what I mean? Like it's going it's it's bringing controversy regardless. But for me, I feel like they should be able to move how they wanna move and dress how they wanna dress and go to whatever bathroom they feel comfortable at the end of the day. So Y'all gotta relax. Go ahead, Leo. What you think? I agree with that. I feel like um, people um, have a hard time understanding trends. Mm-hmm. And they always think, oh, you just wanna be this or you just wanna be that. No, some people really just wholeheartedly wish that they were another gender or born another gender. And you know, sometimes it's a mental thing. Like, it's a mental um, health awareness. Thing mm-hmm. and everything like you cannot sit up here and settle. It's just like being gay, right? Some people coming out to your parents. Mm-hmm. And transgenders have the same trauma. Exactly. And for me, I think that if they would like to go to the bathroom as a woman and they're a man, go to the bathroom mm-hmm. because at the end of the day, they can sit on that toilet like a woman can. Exactly. Exactly. And if a man and if a girl wants to go to a bathroom as a man and she decides she wants to stand up, better her do that. Exactly. I mean. I feel like these days y'all judge people too fucking much. Too much. Y'all judge people business. too much. Like, too much. if this was how would make somebody happy, why would you want to try to steal their joy? Mm-hmm. That is weird to me. Mm-hmm. And I feel like you're insecure in yes. that point. Yes. But I'm gonna leave that there and let somebody else go. Go see. What you feel like? Who gives a fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Be yourself. Live your life. You on a motherfucker. It's gonna be in one casket. Mm-hmm. So you do you, boo. Mm-hmm. I don't got no problems with no trans, no gay, no nothing. I support everything. Cause yeah. yeah. Look at me. I mean, I, I ain't no trans though, but you know, shit. I, I support my people regardless. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So you go ahead and do you, boo. I don't got no problems. Mm-hmm. How you feel, Moose? I'm big pan, baby. <laughs> <laughs> I think everybody's minding your motherfucking business. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Go in that bathroom if you want to be in that bathroom. It don't matter what's in your pants, what's what in your shirt, you and how you lay down. Mm-hmm. That don't got nothing to do with nobody. I think that you should be the best motherfucker. If you're going to be the baddest bitch, you're going to be the baddest bitch. Mm-hmm. You're going to be the most quiet ninja, you're going to be the quietest ninja. You hear me? Do what you do. Fuck all the other shit. Mm-hmm. Fuck them. Fuck their opinions. Fuck all that. Yeah. Hey. I agree 120 mm-hmm. percent. So it's just any like transgender people watching. I want you to know that you're loved, baby. Shout out to all you. of us, all Shout of us. You. And I want you to live in your truth and always, mm-hmm. no matter right. what. If it, if, even if it makes a motherfucker feel uncomfortable, and it makes them feel uncomfortable, fuck. that means you're doing something. And you're doing right. it correct, baby. That's right. Because nobody should be feeling uncomfortable about how you are. You live as a person. Like what? If they are stable in their seat. Mm-hmm. They remain mm-hmm. on tens all the time. Yes. Don't don't don't, don't switch up what you do. Don't go in yep. front of another crowd doing nothing. Period. And get in this crowd and do this thing. No, be yourself. Because Whatever. people gonna always affect you for being you. You will never know how much love you will get just off the solely being you. Mm-hmm. And you always stand out too. Yes. That's what different. makes you different. different. You feel me? Like. You was born that way. You know how you want to be. You know, like yeah. when you're growing up, you feel that jump. Like when you really like something, you like it. And if you want to change your body, it's your body. Yeah. Your body, your rights, your doing. privilege. Period. Do what you want with your body. Don't let nobody ever down talk y'all and say that y'all got to be a certain way. What? 
they ain't living your life and they ain't in the skin you in. Do okay. you. Like, yeah. do you 100%. And love the skin. Yes. That you are in. Right? Yes. So just live your life. Hey. hey. Okay, so I want opinions about how y'all feel about top and bottom surgery. So for me personally, I don't care. Okay, if you do whatever you want to do with your body again, you feel me? Like if you want to change that tip thing, then change that tip thing. That ain't hurting nobody. Do what you want to do and what you're comfortable with. Because when you look it down there, I feel like for transgender people, when they want to be a woman, they look down there, they get, you know, they get discouraged. Like dysphoria. I want to be, yeah, dysphoria, exactly. They want to be something else, so let them be that. If it's surgery and they can afford it or not, do you know how much that surgery costs? Baby, that's an arm and a leg. So if somebody saving up their coins for that, you bitches BBL. Uh -huh. And we don't say nothing about y'all, so don't say nothing about them. If they want to do that, let them do that. If they got the money and the support and all that, let them do that. Let that's their best life, okay? Though. And they real skin to them. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So if that's what they want to do, let them do that. Go ahead, sweet. My thing is, if you ain't fucking nobody worried about it, mm -hmm. If that mouth that if, if, if them titties that, and that whatever ain't going on you or inside you, why would you worry about it? Mm -hmm. Mind your business. You'll live happier for your business. Good, okay. It's zero dollars and zero cents to mind your business. That's so big for me, Coleo. Okay. How I feel about it, I feel like it, you should do it if you want to do it. Mm -hmm. You know? Because who wants to sit being miserable? If that's not in who a they foreign are. body, yes. Like you know what? Who it's 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 like very very similar to depression. Yes, know? it is. And it's like, why would I sit here and be in somebody I'm not when I really want to be this person? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Faking it. A lot of people say fake it till you make it, but that shit only gonna get you so far. Exactly. So I feel like if that is what you honestly and truly wholeheartedly want to do, I feel like it's okay. There's nothing wrong with that. Like, it's a lot of weird stuff going around in this world. That's not the weirdest thing to do. Mm -hmm. And if it makes you happy, then do that. I mean, that's just how I feel. Like, shit. If I wanted to be a man tomorrow, I, if I truly want to, I would. Exactly. Nobody's not going to take that who from me. Her? Take that joy from me. Nobody's and who's going to do her something? Who's going to say something? Who's going to do her something? Oh. oh, okay. Because at the end of the day, everybody's sexuality is different. You don't get straight men or straight women bashed every fucking day because exactly. they fucking and suck it. Exactly. So why would somebody else's business have to do with their sexuality? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's that. That's, that's that. On that's it. it. That's all. That's it. Well, no, Me? I just root back to the original statement, bitch. Fuck what they got going on. <laughs> like, you hear me? Like, it just is what it is. Yeah. Like, none of that shit matters to me. I feel like I will never dictate my livelihood off of now. Yeah, because why would you? And I'm not giving you no explanation. No. Because who are you? Like, who are you going to tell me that I can do what I want to okay, do with my body? Are you wiping my ass? Fuck? No. Excuse me? You eating this Okay. If it's anybody in your life, like, right now, I'm telling you that you should, if you want to change your body, they're telling you you shouldn't do it. And Stay try to yourself. Fear into your goals and what you want to do with your body. Cut them off. Have your own speaking space. I'm not trans. I'm not that's trans. not okay. I'm not trans. Because only your only your insecure motherfucker will try to change your mind about that's it. That's right. I'm not trans, but that's I am pan, right. and people really don't understand me. They mm -hmm. be like, so. So maybe that should be the next topic. So you talk, talk to girls. Yeah. You talk to guys. Mm -hmm. oh, wait, you like studs? Or oh, you like girls? Or oh, you like niggas? It's none of your business. And I just be like, I like what I like. Why did you think even in, in depth in life? Why do you care about where I stick my shit? Like, what the fuck? People be so worried about the wrong shit. Like, like worried about the fuck? What the fuck? You want to turn? None of that stuff matters to me. I feel like everybody should be great. Everybody should keep their head up high. Mm -hmm. Bitch, I don't give a fuck about what skin you in. I don't give a fuck about what color you is. I don't give a fuck about none of that, what your sexuality is, what your orientation is, what your pronouns is. If you are living in that skin that you in, you gonna rock that shit like it's a motherfucking. A uh, leather jacket that was your favorite when you was three years old. You gonna rock that hole until the seams okay. come out. Okay, just getting on you. Okay. Read that motherfucking book. Mm-hmm. Read me at the place that I've been hating around. Oh. They're acting like they running shit. They ain't really ran for Huh? What? They ain't ready. They ain't ready. That's a whole different topic. <laughs> The last topic is sexual relations. So that goes back to uh, what Lucy was saying. 
how he feel like you know whatever you have whatever you do how you do it who you doing that's your business okay mm-hmm. and nobody should tell you because you look you a transgender man you can't mess with men you can't you can do whatever you want whatever, whatever your heart desire for sure like do what do it like if, if that's, that's what, what you like if like that's it. what if that's what it, <laughs> shut up if that's what get that him, yeah <laughs> then that's what it do you hear me Oh my Fuck all that. Don't care about what nobody's what saying. Happened? None of that stuff matters, bro. <laughs> like, none of it they matters. They're not paying your bills. Mm-hmm. They don't dictate your happiness. Exactly. They're not making sure you good at night. They're not calling you when you're having down times. Mm-hmm. They're not calling you when you are fucked up in the head and you like, oh my God, I'm up. Mm-hmm. The addictions, because some people have addictions, they're not calling you when you're having your drink or you're smoking your cigarette. Or you don't relapse. Or you don't relapse. Mm-hmm. They're not calling you, so none of that shit matter. You live, me, I'm going to live. Mm-hmm. You hear me? I like it all, baby. Okay. And I'm going to live in my skin. Okay. And I'm going to make sure I hold my head up high. And I don't give a fuck. I'm I don't wish somebody was. Okay. Because who going to do a fuck? I wish somebody was. They not. I really, really do. Bye bye bitches. Just worry about yourself. What you. Just because, it's and then it's easy. It's so it's hard. hard. It's okay. It's easy. It's not a hard thing to mind your business. It's called zero dollars, zero cents. And for all the people out there that's really like being weird to transgender people, y'all weird as fuck. Cause y'all need to leave them alone. They living in their truth. Mm-hmm. You probably can't even live in your truth. You or probably you, still worried about somebody else, baby daddy. But you ain't got even got yours. Or just oh, that truth be told, half of y'all motherfuckers be living a lie. Mm. Uh, they probably want to be like that motherfucker. Yeah, exactly. They y'all want to be trans. Uh huh. Y'all want to be trans, and, and y'all want to do sprints. And I feel like child. people that are like strongly opinionated about mm-hmm. certain things, like you're living a lot. There's something that's mm-hmm. in there that's bothering them. Like you're really like sit up here going so fucking hard about somebody else. You're living a lot. Absolutely. Cause you ain't happy Damn. with yourself. I'm so sorry, camera. <laughs> but if you're not happy with yourself, it's gonna show. Because if you're so bothered by a transgender person breathing the same air as you or being next to you and all that stuff, that's not even not just like transgender air. though. Oh, if I'm, if you are bothered, I'm just talking about transgender right now because that's the. But if you are with. bothered by anything other than anything that's related to what the fuck the situation is. Something is wrong with you. I don't give a fuck if I got nail polish on. Yes. I don't give a fuck if I got a tattoo like on. Us right now. I don't give a fuck if my car was pink. Film, film, I don't yeah, care. You know? yeah. I don't care if I like applesauce and you like homemade applesauce. <laughs> Why the fuck is that a bother something to like, you? Like, people are too None entitled. None of that matter. Like, they be so entitled to their opinion. Feeling like, everything matter. gotta be how they think. The no, world no, gotta be no, how you think. Go right back to insecurity. It's, that's literally what it's heavy. On the insecurity, baby. Everybody there got go. their own opinion. Everybody do. Go. You're entitled to so, it, but you don't have to make somebody else uncomfortable because of how you feel. Exactly. That's not how they feel, so don't. If it's not nice, you'll know, you know your mama told, told you not to say it. You don't got nothing to say, bitch. That's nice. Don't, don't say nothing at all. Hello. Excuse me. You know what? Y'all should not really be trying to tear people down. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And y'all try to tear them down so fucking low. Like, you want somebody to feel like that? Mm-hmm. Right. Because you feel like that in the inside. It's very disgusting. It is. Very disturbing. You're just, your character. It's ugly. very odd. I mean, it's very ugly. strange. Yes. yes. And one thing I learned in school, treat other people the way you want to be treated. Right. If you don't, you're going to tell every time. And start learning that don't study me because you will never graduate. If you worried about what I'm doing. You better write that down. Don't study me because you will not graduate. You better write it down. Because you have never to, uh, understand until you fully <laughs> understand. Leo, next, she need to do her. Leo, I'm going to put you on the pulpit. Okay? Because <laughs> she got something to say. She's like, my over here. Because if you start trying to worry about what I'm doing to study my fucking crap, mm-hmm. you won't graduate because you, your eyes not on your own paper. Exactly. Your eyes you not on your own paper. Hello? Mind yours. Mind yours. Got to. Okay. Worry about what you got going on. You can cheat your way in life, but cheaters never win. Mm-mm. Absolutely. Mm-mm. And that's one thing and you will you never be a winner. That's what you okay. need to understand. You'll never. Ever. So if you worry about understanding another motherfucker's logic and what they do and why they do it, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Power off. See what I'm saying? Power off. <laughs> that, she said it for me. Power off. <laughs> I'm screaming. Cut his fucking mic. Ah, what time is it? Cut his fucking mic because I'm telling you right now. You you will never understand. It's 1236. Ciao. And that's the, that's the, I mean, that's the greatest advice I need. So before this camera go off, I want to tell y'all, be great into yourself. Yes. Don't give a fuck about what nobody got to say. Love yourself. I don't give a fuck. Oh, nobody will. Says. 
Because nobody else ain't going to give you the love that you're going to give yourself. Yes, Baby, I promise you. Mm -hmm. Love yourself. Don't give a fuck about what they got to say. Wear what you want. Do what you want. Dress how you want to dress. Date who you want to dress. If you want to do some <laughs> kinky shit, do that shit too. And not give a fuck. Don't give a fuck at all. Don't give a fuck. Be unapologetic, baby. Live your life. For sure. Just live your life. Hey. 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 That motherfucking paper. Okay. Don't trip off shit, but your bitch. Okay. Come on, bitch. But all in all, I think we could agree solely that transgenders, y'all are accepted by us. Y'all are beautiful. I love y'all. Y'all beautiful. Y'all do what y'all want to do with y'all bodies. Y'all do what y'all do with y'all sexuality. Y'all do what y'all want to do with y'all life, period. And I love a free spirit. I love somebody who doesn't give a fuck about what nobody says. They're going to do what they want to do regardless of the fact. I love that because it shows that you're a leader and not a follower. Exactly. You love what you love. Don't give a fuck about who. Hashtag love. love. Yeah. Hashtag love is love. Exactly. Love. And make sure you guys put in the description. I mean, not description. Put that in the comments down below. Love is love. Yeah. Make sure you guys love. comment down below like more topics that y'all want to see. Yes, please. Because we need more like juicy stuff. Yes, because we always eat. Mm -hmm. This one right here, she want to cook. And I would love to show y'all. Don't, don't, don't get me wrong, because they motherfuckers be cooking too. Okay, we do. We you do. got me beat. They oh. cook now. She don't got me beat. She puts it down. She now, got me beat. Like I said, I just got here. <laughs> Go get you something. A chicken salad. Oh my Hello. gosh. Anyway, Thank guys. You <laughs> if you if you are transgender and watching right now and you need some help and you want somebody to talk to, I got the trans lifeline number right now. It's 877-565-8860. It'll be on the screen because I'm put it there. Make sure you give it a call. If you feel it down, I really want you guys to get the help that you need mm -hmm. and somebody to talk to who's not going to judge you. So, yeah, give that line a call if you ever feel it down and you need some help. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Because that's important. And I feel like everybody deserves to talk to somebody who really just there to listen. Somebody mm -hmm. Sometimes you need somebody just to listen. Yeah. Not just a voice. Just a, just yeah, a I'm ear. Telling yes. you, like, one look in the shoulder can save somebody's life. Yes. Absolutely. And remember, you are your own person. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, brace just, it. Just go for it. And know? don't be scared to get help because I. Speaking from a personal experience, I know that it's hard when you're going through some stuff. Mm -hmm. And you don't know who to go to. You don't know what to do. Don't be scared to reach out. Right. If y'all got to hit me in my DMs, hit me. Because I'm going to reply. Okay. Because I don't like that shit. I don't like it at all. Make sure if you need somebody, get somebody. See something, say something. If you hear something, feel something. Speak say something. something. Yes. Speak something. Speak it. Hello. Speak it. Call it. It's very important. You know who likes you save it. And if somebody really... Just come out of nowhere, like, can I talk to you? Just listen, please, yeah. because you Absolutely. never know. You might be their last resort before they just take it and all off. In the words of our pastor, everybody got a key to somebody's door. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Heavy. So, speak, speak that key holder. You never know so what, you, what you, what blessings you hold upon somebody else's life and somebody holds upon your life. Yes. yes. Pastor James O. James. Yes. Serious. Yes. Yes, and karma is gonna come around, so I, I suggest y'all just be nice to y'all people. What goes just around nice. comes back around. Hey, my baby. <laughs> 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 I'm gonna sit my way with a little red one. Twist this out of No, she didn't just bust out the beat. Bitch, my wig flew off. Now she bust out the beat. Bitch, I was capitalist. My baby. On Candy Camera. <laughs> That's our cue to get off this day. Yeah. I love you guys so much. I thought oh. that you did everything right. No wrong. Who right here? Uh, uh, must have been out of my mind. Had it out. I got a time that I Okay. Uh, Let me end the video. Let me end the video. <laughs> If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Turn your post notifications because you don't want to miss a beat. I'm about to be. You don't want to miss a beat. Hello. Hello. Don't want to miss a beat. Hello. If you guys are to this channel, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Turn your post notifications because you don't want to miss a beat. I love you guys so much. Thank you for tuning to this video. Y'all stay blessed and we are out of here.